Hi, today I'd like to show you this very beautiful and rare natural crystal. Now this beautiful crystal, this is a twin crystal, and also this is a Brandberg crystal, and it's an anhydro, and this does have a very small ancient moving bubble. And if you can see, I've marked the crystal here with the black marker right there. It's very tiny. That's where the ancient anhydro bubble is at. And normally I find it's easier to see with some type of like magnification and also some uh, safe and proper backlighting that's bright. But when I safely and carefully turn the crystal, you can see right there, there you go. It has very good movement of this anhydro bubble. The only thing is it's kind of very tiny though, but it does have very good movement. The water that's inside of here also, this is uh, regarded as extremely pure, having never been touched before by human hands ever. And I do have this zoomed in also, so hopefully you're able to see the movement a bit easier right now of the ancient and hydro bubble. And while I have this zoomed in very quickly, I'd like to show you also if you can notice here on this crystal. Now, even though this is a very rare type of crystal, this is still very natural. So this does have a lot of the natural like markings you can see on the crystal on numerous areas, even like on the points and the faces. This has like the nicks, also the chips. This has like some contact markings and dings and scuffs. Also, this may have little holes in certain areas as well. This also has like fissures even imprints and also the indentations on this crystal just on numerous areas and that's because it's taken this type of crystal a very long time to grow and form in nature and when this crystal was growing and forming in nature in close proximity to the other crystals that are growing and forming in nature and you know it could take these type of crystals a very long time also to grow and form in nature so it leaves them plenty of time that they have to like poke and scratch each other. And that's what this crystal has just done on numerous areas. You can see a little rainbow right there also. And this is all just naturally occurring in nature. It's part of a very long, beautiful growth process. And I just wanted to make sure though that everyone knows and is aware of that, that this does have a lot of the natural markings and nicks here and the scratches and the chips the holes, the contact markings, dings, scuffs, imprints, and indentations, and also the fissures. And even though this is a beautiful twin, you can see also how this has some really, really beautiful phantoms here. Sometimes they're hard to see. You have to hold this crystal very safely and carefully at the right angle and the right type of lighting to see the phantoming patterns. They're very beautiful though. You can see right there. And this crystal also does have some beautiful uh, translucency in some areas as well. This is 42 grams. And also with a Brandberg crystal, it's reported that no matter what color a Brandberg crystal is, that this is reported to have all of the metaphysical properties of an amethyst, a smoky, and a clear quartz crystal also, just so everyone knows and is aware of that as well. You can see there's a little bridge crystal right here where my thumbnail is at. This is also a skeletal celestial. It's a twin, it's the anhydro crystal, it has the tiny rainbow. Even though the rainbow, it's not always visible, now this still does have the metaphysical properties of the rainbow crystal also, just so everyone knows and is aware of that as well. And what I'd like to do though very quickly is I would like to pause this so I can uh, zoom back out and then I'll come back and I'll briefly talk about some of the metaphysical properties of this crystal as well because this does offer a lot of metaphysical properties. But I'm going to pause this so I can zoom back out and I will be right back. Okay, and I'm back. This is such a very beautiful, 
and rare natural crystal. And I love how this looks out here in the natural lighting. The colors kind of pop. It's just so beautiful out here in the natural lighting, this crystal. There we go. Should turn a bit better here. Throughout the making of this video, I'm definitely going to be turning a lot and turning this crystal a lot also. So hopefully you're able to see this crystal in full and better details from some different angles, just so everyone knows and is aware of that. And this also does look like it has a little fenster right in there, just so everyone knows and is aware. Right in here also. You turn a bit better again here. And within different types of crystal healing sessions and meditation techniques. Now this is a crystal that's reported by numerous individuals as this is an ultimate type of like self-help, self-healing type of crystal. This crystal is known as an all-purpose healer and also known as the great problem solver of the crystal world. Amethyst is also known as a stone of attraction. This is a crystal that may help you to attract the energies that's needed to attract a soulmate and even more like loving, high vibrational, positive energies to your life. And this is a twin crystal also, and this is reported to be incredibly beneficial to help you with any type of relationship problems or worries. This is a crystal that may help you to get to like the root issues of any problems that you're having if you are having any type of relationship or family type of problems. This may help you to effectively communicate with your partner and your loved ones. So hopefully anything that's uh, bothering you that you can talk about it and address it. So hopefully anything that's uh, going on in your life that's worrying you or bothering you will not continue to happen. This is also a crystal that's reported to be very beneficial to help you with like empathy, with kindness, patience, acceptance, bravery, courage, optimism. Also, this may be very beneficial to help you with unconditional love and even forgiveness and reconciliation. This is a crystal that may help you to rekindle that spark and that passion also within your relationship. Let me turn a bit better again here. Just want to make sure you can see this from some different angles. Individuals, they've also reported that with uh, this type of crystal as well, that this may help you to be more uh, spiritually connected. Even this is beneficial for emotional healing, emotional balance, emotional strength, emotional development. And also this is reported to be very beneficial to help you with emotional maturity as well. This is reported to be like a catalyst for great and major changes to happen within your life. And this is also reported to be the perfect type of crystal to gift someone who you have like a crush on. And it can even be like a, like a best friend that you can give this to. Someone to let them know that you truly care about them and you're ready for like a more uh, emotional and deeper commitment as well. This may help you to rekindle like that stability and that trust within your relationship as well, individuals have reported. And regarding a soulmate, a soulmate doesn't necessarily have to mean someone that you're in a romantic relationship with. A soulmate can be someone who you've incarnated with, who helps your uh, soul to like heal and grow and learn here. And it can be anyone that's like a, a good friend, a family member, even like a, a business associate. Also, it could be uh, someone that you are in a romantic relationship with as well. And this crystal is also known as an amulet of protection. This may help you to guard and protect you, your loved ones, even your home, your property, and also your belongings. And long ago, and even still practice today, individuals, they've uh, taken could be a smoky quartz crystal or a crystal that does have some smoky quartz within it and they used to place them near like the openings in their uh, homes it could be like windows or doorways but they placed them very safely and carefully of course to help to prevent like unwanted uh, spirits from drifting in to their uh, family's space this is reported to be very beneficial for spiritual growth spiritual guidance spiritual protection and spiritual progression this may also help you with spiritual healings and cleansings and even individuals have reported that this is beneficial for spiritual awakenings 
And this may help you to reclaim any missing or lost soul fragments also individuals have reported. This is a crystal that may help you with ascension and on your journey to enlightenment. This may help you to attract good luck, love, wealth, good health, prosperity, positivity, balance, joy, harmony, peace, unity, even more abundance to your life. This is a crystal also that's called the crystal of the angels. And this may help you to facilitate communications with angels and spirit guides. This may also help you to access and feel their love, their guidance, their wisdom, and also their protection. And not just the angels and the spirit guides, but also this may help you to facilitate communications with the archangels. Even with like nature spirits and elementals. Also with water divas. With the earth and minerals. With plants and animals also. With ghosts and orbs. With spiritual teachers and ascended masters. Even with like distant star beings. Also individuals have reported that this may help you to facilitate the communications with like ancient and divine beings, with cryptids. Let me turn a bit better here. I know it's a bit windy also right now, so I truly do apologize if it's loud. I hope that everyone is still able to hear me okay. And this is a crystal also that may help you to facilitate communications with like the higher realms. Let me turn a bit better here. Also with like goddesses, guardians, even with beings from other like realities and dimensions, this is reported that this may help you to facilitate communications with. And this is also reported by individuals that this is incredibly beneficial to help you to activate, increase, and improve your psychic abilities. And this may help you with different types of abilities such as like clairaudience and clairvoyance. This may also help you with like ESP, with scrying, gazing, channeling. Also, this may help you with like uh, psychometry. Even individuals have reported that this is very beneficial to help you with like psychic visions, with prophecy, telepathy, divination. I've had individuals report that this is very beneficial to help you when you're working with portals and automatic writing and dowsing. This may help with any type of like uh, psychic work in mediumship. Even this may help when you're working like with herbs and aromatherapy, even crystal light healing with that type of therapy as well. Also astrology and tarot card readings and this is reported to be very beneficial to help you with any type of metaphysical work and different individuals, they are reporting different types of abilities over different time spans with this type of crystal as well. This is reported to be very beneficial to help you with deeper meditative states. This may help you with guided and unguided meditation, this crystal. This may help you with shamanic journeys, and angel work, dream work, light work, grid work, and even body healing layouts. This is reported to be very beneficial for like self-healing, soul healing, and karmic cleansing. This may help you with psychic protection and protection during ceremonial work, spells, and protection during rituals. This is reported to be very beneficial to help with different types of rituals also, even rituals that are related to like the moon and the solstice, rainbow goddess rituals, rituals that are related to like stress and energy, relationships and love, also health and healing, even rituals that pertain to like learning and leadership. Also protection and even abundance rituals as well, individuals have reported. I've even had individuals report this is very beneficial when it pertains to rituals that are related to like banishing and also rituals that are related to the earth. This is reported to be very beneficial to help you with earth healing. And this may help to ground you to Mother Gaia and even bond you closer to Mother Earth and nature, individuals have reported. This may help and be very beneficial with Reiki, with Feng Shui, with Wicca, Paganism, Buddhism, Spiritualism, multi-dimensional healing, group spiritual work, just all types of healing work this is reported to be beneficial for. And this may help you with like astral projection and astral travel assistance. Also past life healing assistance this may be very beneficial for. 
and this may help you to promote and provide a direct link to the Akashic Record, which may help you to access ancient wisdom and even past, present, and future knowledge. This is very healing for the body, the mind, the spirit, and the soul, this crystal. And this may help you to like heal, cleanse, purify, repair, protect, harmonize, and balance. And it's very cleansing also for your auric fields. This may help you to like open, activate, cleanse, harmonize, balance, re-energize, realign. This is reported that this can just work with all of the chakras. And this is a master healing quartz crystal. And this may help you to heal through almost any ailment or illness that is affecting you. This is also reported to be very beneficial to help you to get rid of like negativity and bad moods and evil. This may also help you to get rid of like lower level entities and unwanted energy attachments. This is also reported by individuals that this may help you to like delete like any type of like uh, blockages stagnant energies but when uh it pertains to physical health a lot of different individuals they are reporting a lot of different types of abilities and metaphysical properties and effects just like crystals they're all different and unique so are individual people so sometimes with the same type of mineral different types of experiences and properties have been reported this may help to heal the heart both physically and also emotionally. This may help like your cardiovascular system and circulatory system as well. This is also reported to be very beneficial to help with some blood diseases and disorders and even cancers. This may help within some uh, cancer and radiation treatments and even issues related to tumors. Let me turn a bit better here. This is also reported by individuals that this is very beneficial to help to heal the skeletal system. This may help like your spine and vertebrae and even this may help with facet joint pain. This may help with some degenerative diseases and also uh, this may help with some skin diseases and skin disorders individuals have reported. This may help if you have problems with like arthritis, lordosis, arthrosis, rheumatism, fibromyalgia, osteoporosis, and even this is reported that this may help with gout. You can see right there some of the markers already started to come off where the anhydro is at. So I just wanted to make sure that everyone knows and is aware. I'm definitely going to remark where this very tiny anhydro is located. So hopefully everyone is able to find and see the anhydro movement a bit easier. But remember, it's very tiny. It's very hard to see and find, and it may require uh, some sort of magnification and safe, proper backlighting that's bright as well, just so everyone knows and is aware of that. This is also reported to be beneficial to help with issues related to, like, your ankles and your feet, your legs, your knees, also your hips, even your wrists and your arms, also your shoulders. Individuals have reported this may help. This may help with issues related to your eyes, your ears, your nose, and your throat. This may also help with some dental pain and issues related to like your teeth. Let me turn a bit better again here. And this is also reported to help you with like pain relief and stress relief. This may help your uh, digestive system and the gastrointestinal tract. This may help within treatments of like IBS, Crohn's disease, gastritis. And also this may help with like heartburn and nausea and indigestion. This may help like your thyroid and parathyroid. And this may help you to stimulate the pineal, the pituitary, and all of the endocrine glands. This is known as an all-purpose healer. And even this is reported to be like a natural antiviral and anti-inflammatory. This may help you to alleviate like swellings and bruisings. This may help the brain. This is also reported to help the thymus, and this may help with, like, strengthening the brain function. This is also reported to help the liver. This may help your lungs and respiratory system and respiration. This is reported by individuals to be very beneficial to help with men and women's reproductive organs. And this may help with some fertility treatments, but remember, this does work different for different individuals metaphysically. 
and this may help with some hormonal imbalances. And I've even had individuals report that this may help with issues related to sexual dysfunction and your libido. This may help your pancreas, your spleen, your gallbladder, your bladder, your kidneys. This is also reported to help you to stimulate the immune system. And this may help you to promote cellular regeneration. And that is for a speedy recovery when you're not feeling well. This may also help you to alleviate some headaches individuals have reported. This may help the body's natural ability to help to like heal and repair itself. And this may help with like DNA and RNA. This is also reported to help to remove and reduce toxins from the body. And individuals have reported this is incredibly beneficial to help you to remove and reduce addiction from your life. Remember, this does work different for different individuals, though. This may help with some, like, sex addiction, some food addiction, drug addictions. This may help you to not want to drink and smoke that much, individuals have reported. This may help you to alleviate some of the feelings that's associated with withdrawal, detoxification, and addiction. Feelings such as, like, agitation, anger, aggression, depression, bitterness, loneliness hopelessness, even fears and phobias, even feelings of resentment and shame, stress, guilt, heartaches and traumas and feelings of inadequacy and jealousy. This may help you to remove and reduce if you're experiencing those types of feelings. And this may help to increase your willpower, your drive, your determination, your perseverance. This is reported to be very beneficial to help you to increase your self-confidence, your self-esteem, even your courage and your bravery. If you were to keep this very safely and carefully also near your work environment or like a healing treatment area or space, even if you were to keep this on your altar, individuals, they've reported that this is very beneficial to help you to increase and improve your mental clarity, your mental health and your mental sobriety. This is also reported to be very beneficial to help you to increase your creative energies, and this may help you with the expansion of your imagination and the expansion of your consciousness as well. This may help to bond you closer to coworkers and colleagues, and this may help to filter out like bad moods and distractions. This may help you to get rid of the negative energies from people, from places, from things, and also the negative energies from the environment and atmosphere. turn a bit better here this may help you to increase your energy which may help your work productivity and this may help you to increase and improve like your focus your memory your concentration your learning abilities your problem-solving skills your decision-making capabilities and your leadership qualities even your bonding abilities this is reported to be beneficial to help with and this may help you to remove and reduce the electromagnetic smog and radiation from the environment that's emitted from like cell phones and computers, even like radios, TVs, also like Wi-Fi, speakers, Bluetooth, headphones, all types of electronic devices. This may help you to feel more revitalized, re-energized, and refreshed. This may help to like comfort you in great times of sorrow and sadness. This may help you to manifest your deepest wants and desires into reality. And this may help you to amplify and cleanse energy and cleanse other crystals and cleanse yourself. If you go to www.etsy, which is spelled E-T-S-Y dot com backslash sublime soul gifts. That's all one word and that is spelled S-U-B-L-I-M-E-S-O-U-L-G-I-F-T-S. I will have a lot more pictures of this very beautiful and very rare natural crystal. Not just pictures, but I'm also going to have a lot more information if you'd like to learn more on how this can help you. Since I'm only touching base on uh, some of the metaphysical properties, and this does offer just a lot more metaphysical properties. This is a crystal that may help you to feel better like mentally and physically, spiritually and emotionally. Also, this is reported to be very beneficial to help you if you're experiencing any bad dreams or nightmares. This may help you with insomnia and even lucid dreaming. This is reported to be beneficial to help with. I've even had individuals report this may help with issues of sleepwalking. But remember, this does work different for different individuals. Let me turn a bit better here. This may help you to have a more tranquil and serene feeling environment and atmosphere. This may help you to like balance meridians. 
even male female energies and even the yin and yang elements i've had individuals report this is beneficial when you're working with your shadow self and higher self and this can also untangle timelines this may help to bridge the gap and the divide between like our world and realms and other worlds. This may help to bond you closer to like the earth, the nature and the universe, bond you closer to other individuals and reconnect with them. And this may also help you to reconnect to yourself. This is very healing, very grounding, balancing, nurturing, supportive, inspirational, very spiritual and very protective. And this does offer a lot more metaphysical properties, but I just wanted to touch base on a few of them here. And thank you so very much, everyone, for taking the time to view this video. This may also help you through all sorts of, like, uh, transformations, transitions, and changes within your life. This is reported to help you to be the very best you that you can be. And this is also called a conduit for more love and light to enter into your being. I appreciate everyone, and I hope that everyone has a very beautiful and wonderful day. Thanks.